Number 10. House Built on a Rock, Drina River, Serbia. This small house has been balancing on a rock and surviving through thick and thin for 47 years. Back in 1968, a bunch of young swimmers climbed up on this rock to rest, and they decided they wanted a more comfortable place to relax. They built a sort of shelter to protect themselves from the sun, but the next year, it was turned into a real one-room house by one of the swimmers. Number 9. The Finnish House in the Woods in Finland, laws allow you to build a small dwelling without a permit if it's less than 96 to 128 square feet, depending on the location. In 2010, a designer decided he wanted to build his own house, and while hiking in the woods one day, he found the perfect place. But since he knew he wouldn't be able to build a normal-sized home within six months to a year, he decided to build a smaller one. Believe it or not, he took only two weeks to buy the required materials and build this cute cabin. Number 8. The Raven Loft, Pender Island, Canada Pender Island is situated off the coast of British Columbia, Canada, in the Gulf of Georgia. The house you see here is the brainchild of Jeff De Reuter, a graduate student who was looking to create a more sustainable lifestyle for himself. So he perched his house atop some pine trees. It only covers 165 square feet, and most of the materials used to build it were recycled or repurposed. It's heated by an electric baseboard, and lighting is provided by only two 100-watt light bulbs and six candles. Number 7. Tiny Environmentally Friendly Home when Elizabeth Turnbull was accepted to Yale School of Forestry and Environmental Studies, instead of moving into student housing on campus, she decided to build her own 144-square-foot house. While she was building it, she made sure her home's environmental impact would be minimal by using only FSC-certified wood, non-toxic paints and finishes, and recycled windows. Number 6. Mini Dream who says you can't have the American dream without a big house and a great big lawn? One lady in Washington State built her own American dream and is perfectly happy with 140 square feet of living space. Melissa Tack and her husband Chris submitted their tiny abode for Apartment Therapy's Small Cool Contest in 2013. Located in Snohomish, Washington, the place is basically a bungalow but with an elevated sleeping loft over the kitchen. The wood slats give the home a rustic feel, but the super-sized flat-screen TV in the living room brings it into the 20th 21st century. Number 5. Felice Cohen's rent was just over $700 for a 90-square-foot micro-studio in Manhattan, where you'd typically pay around $2,569 a month for a studio. Cohen, who's a writer and professional organizer, made the most of the space using high, narrow storage units and installing a lofted bed that was just 23 inches down from the ceiling. The studio didn't really have a kitchen per se, but Felice had a toaster oven and a mini fridge, which she'd restock a couple of times a week. Unfortunately, her inventiveness brought her some publicity, and when her landlord saw a video of her flaunting how cool she'd made her mini space, he noticed her name wasn't on the lease and evicted her. She moved to a 500-square-foot apartment just two blocks away, but that had to be much more expensive. Number 4. Little House, Toronto In 1912, a man spotted a space between two larger houses and thought, hey, why not squeeze my own home in there? So he did. He built this minuscule dwelling and lived in it with his wife for 20 years. The house does have everything you'd need, a pull-out bed, a kitchen, a laundry room, a lounge, it even has a small backyard. Number 3. The Smallest House in Italy Designed by Marco Perazzi, Italy's smallest house is just 75 square feet and it occupies a tiny spot in an alley near St. Peter's Square in Rome. Sure, the floor space is almost non-existent, but the designer made the most of the height and built a loft area above the kitchen and living room area. The loft bed turns into a sofa and a trap door for the staircase can be brought down for more floor space upstairs. Number 2. The Smallest House in the UK The smallest house in the UK is also called the Quay House. It's a tiny red home which measures only 10 feet by 6 feet. It's so small, it's become a tourist attraction in Conway, Wales. Built in the 16th century, it's been a home to many people throughout the years, including a 6 foot 3 inch fisherman. Because it's so small, it doesn't house much, but it does have a stove, a water tap, a bed, and some bedside storage. Number 1 Carrot House Could you imagine living in 46 square feet? That's what this tiny home called Carrot House in Warsaw, Poland measures. It's just 5 feet wide, making it possibly the skinniest apartment in the world. 
Polish architect Jacob Szczesny sandwiched it between two buildings in an alley. It doesn't have windows, the kitchen table has room for only two chairs, the microscopic fridge can only contain two sodas, and don't even get me started on the bathroom. The shower head aims almost directly over the toilet. This place really couldn't be any smaller.